I'm going to show you guys how you can take your Roblox character and turn them into your logo for your YouTube channel. It's so easy, so just stick around until the end. So I'm sure you guys know how to get better pictures of your characters, but my knowledge is as far as this. So what I do is I go into a random game on Roblox, right? Like this one, one with good quality, preferably. So find a spot with a pretty blank background so you can cut the background out pretty easy. So like right here, get a nice close up of them. Instead of doing this capture thing, cause I can't seem to find the files. I'm just going to use my snipping tool on my computer. So go to your snipping tool right here, click new, get a little snippet of your guy. Now we can close out of Roblox, click open file screenshots, then bring your snipping tool over here. Click on these three dots, click open file, screenshots, and drag in the one you just took. Scale them up, go up to uh, select and remove background. If it doesn't work the first time, click on this box and do it again. It worked pretty good, so now we're just going to scale them up even more to about right here. Click that check mark. Now we're going to work on the background. So double click on your background, go to gradient overlay, change the scale all the way to five. Double click on this black box, choose a darker color of your choice. And then for this one, choose a little bit of a lighter color and drag this box all the way to the left. Click OK and click OK. Now we're going to add a vignette around him. So click new layer down here. Make sure it's above him. Go to your brush tool. Make sure your top box is black and then hold alt and right click. Drag right to make it bigger, left to make it smaller up to make it softer down to make it harder and drag it to about right here then just kind of draw around him like this leave the top and bottom open and turn the opacity down to about 40. next up we're adding a light spot so click new layer once more make sure this top box is white and scale up your brush just a little bit and boom drop it right there i'm going to turn the vignette down to 30. okay now go up to window plugins and click on this one right here called super bloom and install that. Now it should be right here. Click on it, adjust it to where you like it, and then click add to document. Now since the screenshot of my character is a little bit dark, I'm gonna have to make them a little bit brighter. So I'm gonna go to this layer right here, go up to image, adjustments, and brightness and contrast, and I'm gonna turn the brightness up a little bit. Next up, I'm gonna hit control J on this layer of my character, and I'm gonna click on the bottom one and scale him up. So hit control alt T, put him right behind him, scale him up pretty big. Now just turn the opacity down to like 20% or more. You can even off center him like this. That looks pretty cool too. Just move him around and then find a spot you like. Okay, now we are done. It was super easy. Just go up to file, export as, JPEG, and click save. Don't stop there. If you want to take your designs to the next level, check out my channel membership. You'll get access to hundreds of high quality effects in a massive folder, plus exclusive perks like special badges and more. If you don't want to spend money, no worries. Head over to my Gumroad. I've got tons of free graphics packs ready to download. And don't forget to join my Discord. It's the perfect place to chat with other creators, get feedback on your work, and join in on community events. Links are in the description. Check them out and keep creating.